<laughs> hey, hey, Jelly Toast here. I'm back. Um, there's no audio in the game right now. Uh, let me try talking. Please let me know if you hear things. Welcome back. Thank you. Excuse me. When is the next ship leaving for? Do you Fenwell? hear that? There's no music. It works. Woo! I'm gonna replay everything. I'm afraid the Russian because it wasn't that long. Welcome home, big sister. What the heck? Uh, thanks for letting me know about audio, Maka. Your lifesaver. All scheduled voyages to Fenmon have been canceled. We apologize for the inconvenience. Good thing it didn't. Um, go. you can't hear anything. What? Are any ships? There's no music. It's only dialogue right now. Sorry, ma'am. Ah, uh, but the route to Sapstrath Sea Haven is still open. Would you like a ticket to Sapstrath Sea Haven? Sapstrath. Very well. Please board the ship and await departure. Roundabout we go. Dude, it's actually cold in California now. Like, I'm wearing long pants and a hoodie in such a long time. I freaking love it. And I still have my socks on. Oh, it's great. But Regal, you can't- you still really can't hear anything? Maka, you can hear stuff, right? That's not something you see every day. You get your mail by carrier Pretty pigeon? Pretty stuff. <laughs> something like oh, that. Oh yeah, pigeons. So sexy. <laughs> it's how I keep in touch with someone special from afar. I told her a beautiful woman has appeared in my life. I love everyone's eyebrows. Ugh. Hey, I didn't know you were beautiful. married. Everything's working for me? Okay, good. Do I look like the marrying type to you, Mr. Honor Student? Huh? You mean you're not? Who knows? Ooh, Elvin and his secrets. Like, secret betrayal! Oh, looks like we're about to depart. Yeah. The eyebrows literally look awful. What are you talking about? They're the best eyebrows in the world! Wow. seen the sea before impressive huh I want a Tebow doll now Just looks so freaking cute doing in the village really hope you're joking no they're amazing they're the best what eyebrows you, so big so square maybe it was the other way around maybe she was being protected <laughs> Elise <laughs> Tifo, look! <laughs> Check out that water! You'd die if you fell in! <laughs> She's not a bad girl. It doesn't seem that way. The eyebrows really fit Alvin the best. Probably because no. Jude has more similar hair color to the eyebrows. Take her in. But it seems to match Alvin the best. That's your responsibility. You'll have to find someone on your own. So mean, Mita. Right. I've still got the key, but how much time does it buy me? Oh, yeah, I updated my avatar to have that little hair thing to match Mita. You see something? I also updated my no, I Somnia thinking. Files avatar, so when I play that next time. Elise, I'll have a different avatar instead of that stupid iris. Ugh. I didn't think iris would be that annoying I... when I drew the avatar. I don't know. Huh. What exactly do you know? We know Jude and Mila and Alvin are our pals! <laughs> That's not the sort of thing I meant. What is Tipo, for instance? How can is it what the hells no? Um, it's Date. What do you mean, what's Tipo? You're I will never do Tipo. anything with Ota ever again. Lurking on silent, watching some One Piece with my fiance. Aw, oh, thanks, Birds! How you doing? Hope you're relaxing after your stream. Having a conversation with you is quite well, difficult. yeah, you are. You're watching you One Piece. On Duh. Yeah, it was good to see you on Twitch again. It's been so long. We better get our stuff. You're right. Looks like we're almost there. 
I wonder how tight Rashigal security is right now. How does Tipo not fall off the boat? How does his floating magic work? Mila! Mila's our pal! <laughs> oh. What the heck, Tipo? <laughs> Looks like everyone's getting along at least. I want to stick those eyebrows onto Elise. Don't Hurry worry. up and join my party. Everything will work out. Hey, KV, how you doing? Thanks for joining. I updated my avatar. It has the hair thing now. This port looks exactly like where I left from. What the heck? Looks like security is not so tight. Were after we live too? Soldiers are still patrolling, though. We'll have to be <laughs> careful. At first, I made it too long, and it got cut off by my um, game screen. What so changed? then I had to update it to be a bit shorter. To find us before. So much better now. When do we find out about what that hair thing is, anyway? Maybe they found something more important to do than chase after us. Or Alvin sent a secret message to be like, hey, don't chase after us for a while. I'm, not I'm gonna get the spirits. Let's avoid the soldiers and head to Fenmont. Elise, come with us. Oh, you found out in Zillia too? Holy Hang crap, on, that's Elise. so far. It'll just be a little while longer till we reach the city. It's not gonna be for a long time because I gotta play through Jude's route too. Then I'm sure we'll find the perfect person to take you in. Major spoiler though? Oh, I don't wanna know. I don't, I don't know. She thought she was coming with us. <gasps> Take us in. What the hey are you talking Wah! about? <laughs> that could have gone better. He just told the little lady he's unloading her on a perfect stranger. That's news to her. No wonder she looks surprised. And he thinks I'm inconsiderate. You kind of are, Mina. He's just a kid. Hmm. <laughs> Nothing. Why'd you wink? There was no reason for you to wink there. That's awkward. It's in Zillia too? Oh, okay. Event list updated. Um, let's see if anyone has some quests for us. Getting pretty hungry here. How long Ah! Whoops, didn't mean to start that right now, but cool. Hey there, little girl. <laughs> Hey, buddy. I know our little lady's cute and all, but could you stop leering at her? Oh, sorry. I just couldn't help but notice that stuffed doll she's got. Trade with me. I want that doll. You want a piece of Tipo, pal? Yes! Aha! I knew it! This one talks, too! You mean you've seen a talking doll like this before? Uh, doll quest! Oh, yeah. They look just like that Tipo one. Village? That might be Tipo's family! We gotta get the ball! Where did you see it? A traveling merchant was selling them here a little while ago. He said he was heading west. That must be Sherilton. So there might be other Tipos besides Tipo? That is a possibility. He just said he had a family. That means there's others of him. I want to meet my family! I'm gonna eat your face! Fowl doesn't talk. No, he does not. Uh, near Endgame, they'll show why Mita have that piece of hair. Ah. Yeah, Baal just goes and Tipo actually talks. Wow. These new toys are so impressive. But Tipo's cute. Now I wish I'd bought one for my daughter. Wait, where'd he go? The softest beds in town? What? Trust me. The beds are way softer at the inn here than anywhere else. You focus on the strangest things. All right. I'm checking in. Can we really afford to relax like this? That was the most useless sub event ever. What the heck? Uh, anyways, someone have a quest. Do you have a quest? Hello. Give me a quest. Ah, shoot. I forgot to have this package shipped out. Hey, if you're all headed west, do you think you could deliver this for me? Yes. Great. Please take this to the inn at Charlton. Perfect. 
Capecto. Uh, you'll know why he talks later through the game. Major twist. Um, major twist. He's possessed by a ghost. Expand. Uh, can we expand armor? Donate materials. They want ore. I got some. Yes. All snap. Now I have a feather coat. I'm gonna be so pretty. Um, food vendor. Yeah, I got a ton of grass. There we go. I need to eat more food. Item shop, weapon shop. Weapons, duh. Weapons are more important. Two, three, four, five, six. Yes, Geo Fist. Give me all the stuff. He likes butt stuff, major twist. Oh my gosh. That's why his mouth is so big, to eat butts. All the port basically the same, just different environmental layers. Same with Field Dungeon. Ah, uh, okay. I was confused. I was like, this looks exactly like the port we left from. They're tricking us. Uh, feather coat. Yes. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Equip, yes. Equipped. Iron Helm goes up for Jude. Bronze Circlet goes up for Mida. Heck yes. Half guard? Okay, half guard. 459. Oh wait, no, that's... Yeah, he needs one. And an Iron Helm for my man Jude. And nothing good for Alvin. Bye! Uh, weapons now. Geo fit. I don't have money! Oh, I do have money, huh? I'm gonna run out of money after this, though. Okay. Now I can't buy anything, so uh, let's just get out of here. Um, it bothers people, but it doesn't bother me. I love the character story battle system. I mean, honestly, the battle system alone is just enough to be like, yeah, I don't care about this. Because the battle system is just so good and fun. You there, would you hear my story? Sorry, we're kind of in a hurry. Some other time, all right? Come now, don't be like that. Linger a moment and bring an old man some joy. No! What kind of story? You don't want to go there, Jude. Give this guy an inch and he'll take a mile. Don't worry, young man. I promise the story will be worth your time. Why, it might even save your life! Sounds interesting. Tell us your story. That's more like it. Now hear my tale of monsters. Many years ago, a young man named Trill lived among a northern tribe. Trill had a talent for controlling monsters, an unusual gift that gave him the ability to draw out a monster's hidden powers. But Trill's genius was not easily sated, and he began to dabble in forbidden arts. By tampering with monsters' mana lobes, he sought to create a monster that would grow stronger with every battle. Tamper with mana lobes, but that's not... possible? No, but Trill did it all the same. After over 20 years of research, he successfully created six new monsters. These creatures, with their hyper-enlarged mana lobes, could cast new spirit arts out of pure instincts. Each of the six monsters has a weapon growing out of its body, as if each was a living incarnation of the weapon itself. These weapons were dubbed Devil's Arms, and the monsters themselves, Devil's Beasts. In all my years as a mercenary, I've never heard a story like that. Hehehe, <laughs> of course you haven't, young man. Twenty years ago, Trill took his six Devil's Beasts and led them into a great war. But a huge tsunami hit the battlefield and washed everything away, including Trill. And thus, the secret knowledge needed to create these monsters was lost. That's it? Thanks for wasting our time, old fella. Ah, but the story's not over yet. You see, the Devil's Beast didn't die that day. Trill's death released them, and to this day, they still roam free somewhere in the world. Bum, bum, ba -da. And you say these Devil's Beasts get stronger with every fight? I did, and now that they've been fighting for over 20 years, I can't imagine how strong they must have become. 
So listen well. If you see a monster with a weapon growing out of its body, do not attempt to fight it. That, my friends, is the moral of my little story, and the secret to a long life. Guess what, old man? I'm gonna fight them! That means I get two more party members after Elise. Because there's six. Uh, in Zillia 2, there'll be one really, really annoying thing, and that's how you progress the story. Ooh, not looking forward to that. You get spammed calls to pay debts. If you don't pay, you can't continue. What I do is just pay. Money comes easily in Zillia 2, and weapon armor isn't too important until late game. Uh, the Embassy Man is talking about Devil's Arms. Yeah, like, um, weren't there Devil's Arms in, uh, in Vesperia? I'm assuming that's every character's ultimate weapon. And so that's what I'm thinking. After at least I get two more characters. I can't wait to get them. Hello, music. It's been a long time. Yep, yep. Okay. I am learning. They could make another. Another what? Looks like our wanted poster is making the rounds at the Sea Haven. Hmm. Does this sort of thing actually work? Is it just me or is the voice volume really you low? Tore it down? Yes. But I can't imagine a poster like this will give us any trouble. Do humans have a different sense of aesthetics than I do? Hello, music, my old friend. <laughs> well, anyway. Mila tore down, so we should be safe. More here, kill right? with weapon, the attack goes up. Oh, so it's like Vincent's um what should we call it? Final weapon in Final Fantasy VII. That'll never work. Keep tearing them down and they'll keep putting them right back up. Mila? It's nothing. Alvin's right. Even with this terrible likeness, we can't afford to take chances. We should move on. Alright. Given enough time, they might manage to make a replacement key as well. We need to what hurry. is the key? Mira, what are you talking about? Also, on the lookout for Eifried's treasure. 800 gold! Yay, I have money! Give me your monies! Climb the rock! Open the sack! Kill the bird! Death penalty. Yeah, that was the name of it. I was actually grinding my butt off with Vincent's death penalty on Peanuts 4. Like, I understood how Vincent's final weapon can get stronger. But Tifa's, I didn't understand with her um, premium heart. It's like the more misses you get on her limit break, the stronger it becomes. It didn't seem to get stronger, though. So I just stopped using Premium Heart. Kills everything with one hit, even Sephiroth. For real? Holy crap, that's insanely strong! That's how much you grinded with Vincent? Oh my god. Overflow, exploit, death penalty. Ah. I knew things were too easy. What do we do? Well, hey! What's over yonder? That's the deep wood. Find the cliff! If we can hike our way through there, we'll come out right near Sherilton. Then our path is clear. Of course, they don't give us a short, they easy way. Easy going. What about Elise? You knew she'd face risks on this journey. Elise can handle herself, okay? I'm fine. Really. I can go with you. Don't argue, you guys! You're pals, remember? Pals don't Elise. fight. The girl has agreed, so this matter is no longer open to debate. You're so harsh, Mina. <laughs> then again, I guess she is a spirit, so she's just like, what ofs? Humans are weak. Why do I have to deal with it? Um, I guess I can't really explore anything on this side, huh? Is that that military ship? Yeah, damn it. I want to climb up the cliff. I want to get that treasure chest. Motherfracking. Oh, hello, Sack. Supple ivy, huh? No, is that an ivy treasure? It is not. Uh, took you two months. Holy crap! I just turned on 9999 damage in Final Fantasy VII. How do you do that? Do you use like a Game Shark or something? 
Uh, worth it because it feels so good seeing those damage numbers and symbols. Yeah, I guess. You have a good point. Burn! Ah! Yo, get, get me up. Juggle! Juggle him in the air so that he can't hit us. Yo, come here. Yo, stop. I will fulfill my mission no matter what happens. I'm right there with you. Ooh, those fists look cool. Um Breath of Fire 3 is probably the game that took me the longest to grind. Breath of Fire? Huh. Oh. I tried playing Breath of Fire. It didn't work. The last battle was a little too close. What do you mean too close? Agreed. If Jude hadn't been there to save us, it would not have been. What? Ended well. Was I really in that bad of a shape? You have my thanks. Huh? Sure. Don't worry about it. Even in the midst of combat, you really do look out for others. But taking your focus off your opponents like that could land you in an early grave. What happened to the last battle that the skit is I, happening? I guess it could. Of course, I wouldn't want to fight with someone who didn't give a damn about me either. Use main character Breath of Fire 3, uh, Glue King sword drop rate. Hmm. So keep up the good Breath work. Breath of Fire Jeff. is really good. Yeah, I, I heard it was interesting. That's why I wanted to play it. Will do. I think I tried to play the second one, and it just didn't so in work. Other words, you only want to fight with people who are willing to. So I was them. just like, oh, maybe it's not for me. No, you got it all wrong. Hmm. I only want to fight with people who are willing to help me die old. You seem to know a lot about this area. Never actually been in the deep wood before, but there's a first time for everything. It's a deep state. That actually also happened with me in Final Fantasy V. I was playing Final Fantasy V, and it was going well. And then at some point in the game, it just like kind of glitched out, and I'm like, I can't play past this part. So I just stopped playing Final Fantasy V. I think that's the only main installment Final Fantasy Quite game I haven't beaten. So I just looked up the, what the rest of the story was online. Let's try to stick together, okay? Each part has their own story and characters you can play either. Three is highly recommended. Ah, uh, okay. Maybe I'll pick a Breath of Fire series too. <laughs> but maybe that I'll play on my own time. But I still have so many things to do that- Whoa! Uh, is that an owl or a wolf? It's a wolf. Hello, fight me. Or he knows Elise? Okay. What was that? Elise Joan? What's that mean? Was it warning us, maybe? Well, Mila certainly seems unfazed. Oh, I see a way through! Hurry up, you two! Great, even the spud is getting gutsy. Let's go. Spud is a potato. Oh, Lise join? Haha. <laughs> I want her to join me. I want to give her epic eyebrows. Crawl. Ah, oh, dang it, I thought I could look up her butt. But I can't. And I'm not so good with these tight passages. That's what it must be this astonishing physique said. of mine getting in the way. <laughs> Astonishing physique, you're just fat! Another cutscene for real? Whoa, hello! Load. Thank you. Whoa, I'm not actually playing. That thing's got reach. It can hit all of us with ease. This could pose a problem. And to release! Elise, keep your distance. Y'all keep your distance, man. We can't look after you and fight at the same time. Stay back. Alvin, you have a gun. <laughs> Why aren't you shooting him? Damn it. I I can help. You healed us? She looks so happy! <laughs> Glad you brought us along now, huh? 
I can see why people ship Jude and Elise. Yo! She's on my team! Amazing, Elise. That was exhausting. Excellent. Watch out! Breath of Fire 3 is still my fave. Jonathan says I'm gonna be doing Final Fantasy X next and skipping Tank 2. <gasps> Don't skip 10 oh, to really get the like trophies! That. But yes, Final Fantasy X next. Woo! Elise is the best healer ever. For real? Uh Judah Elise. Um in a previous stream, people were saying that um that a lot of people ship Judah and Elise. Elise, you saved us. It's for the Switch, no trophies? Oh. Well, it comes in a pack, right? So you might as well play 10 2 because you paid money for it. <laughs> Web have good taste. <laughs> no, never. Ah! It's okay, Elise. There's nothing to be scared of anymore. Wait, why is Elise no. crying? Oh, it's because you they. Need to make what? Up. Need to stick together. Make up what? Wait, did we hurt her feelings? I promise I won't get in your way again. Honest. No, you helped us. What? What? You heard the little lady. Now make nice with Jude here for Elise's sake. Make nice? It's not like I'm angry or anything. Your eyebrows say otherwise, Missy. That's not how it looks to me. You were getting along better before. I'll do my best, okay? Why do I suddenly feel like the villain? Because here? you've been so frosty to Elise the whole Fine. time, Mira. I was forgiven. And hey, don't you have something to say to Elise? Yeah, don't you? Sorry for making you worry, and thank you. This is some serious friendship stuff right here. Level ninety nine on the friendship. <laughs> Elise's arts could really help us in a pinch, don't you think so? I already beat it 100% once. Yeah, true. I beat 10 to 100% when it was out on PlayStation 2. But I want to get all the trophies for my PlayStation account, so that's why I need to play through it all again. <sighs> Oops. Like, I'm on chapter 2 or 3 of 10 2, and I already have to restart the game because I missed one line of dialogue Ugh. Ugh, that's on you don't do it on stream please oh no I'm not playing 10 to on stream heck no like her to be along for the ride I feel like not a lot of people would appreciate it and that way I can just like zip through and grind on my own case. Uh, party members changed. Oh, um, 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 Lily more for me first. Uh, let's see. I need arts and I need SP. That is TP. Uh, what's that? Dexterity? Oh, okay. I guess I'll just wait. Jude was expanded. Um, which one gives me an art? Okay, I'll expand. I guess the left side. Yeah? Activate. Activate. Expand! Yes, thank you. Uh, let's see. There's Bolt Strike, HP, TP, Psy, uh, Taunt. I don't care about Taunts. Whirling Assault. I'm guessing that is also a what you call it? Art. Ooh, SP plus seven. Wait. Oh, I guess I have to do this first. And then I could do this. Yeah. That all has to connect. Um, he doesn't have GP yet. Doesn't he have GP yet. Oh, she has a bunch of GP. Um. Tipu Tipo spray. Unlock that. Unlock that. Yes, yes, yes. Unlock that. 
Uh, unlock that. Registration guard, level of store, flash guard. Oh God. Wait, is this an art? Yes, that is an art. Um, support, 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 support. Support. Oh, but that was SP. So dexterity and sigh. Sigh, please. And I might as well unlock this to unlock that. Since Elise is magic, we should do everything with intelligence. And what is this? Strength? Should I give her vitality so she can at least, like, survive? Movement speed and physical defense would also be good. Yeah, let's do that. Give her some agility. HP. SP, yes please. Then I might as well close off these. What? When does it expand again? Curses. At this point I'm gonna learn everything! I am learning everything. Flame orb expanded, cool. Back support, um... Uh, that's intelligence. Healing circle, yes, please. SP. Die. That. Um, let's see. Spirit, max TP by five. Dexperity. 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 Um, vitality, immunity. Combo siphon. Wizard! I like wizard. EP plus seven. Okay. Strategy. I love getting new party members. Um, reduced numbers. Yeah, sure. Uh, prioritize healing. Yeah. Tough it out. Save some TP. Link often. Please prioritize healing. Do not use. Okay. Um, skills. Nope. Mm. Uh, I guess that. Uh, that. Back support. Back support! Yeah. HP gain. Uh, TP gain, I don't know. Level, yeah, sure. Salt magic guard. Win guard. Momentary gain. Flash guard. Flash! Arr! Let's do solid guard. Yeah, there we go. Yay! Uh, set up, please. Set up, please. Platinum so res. You're I still have a platinum resonance of fate? But it's gonna be so short, like, I have so little things to do. I really should do that. Hi, Mom. <laughs> hey, Master, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Um, where did I come from? I think I came from down there. Oh! What? What? Where did you guys come from? Thanks, Jude, for not really attacking. It's Eat it! My sword rings true. Changing the battle camera, I don't care. That wasn't too What's for dinner? <laughs> Insects! That's for dinner, because I'm in a forest. Uh Lilium Orb, Jude. Uh zoom out. I think this is an art, right? Cross counter. Is that an art? Okay, I need to zoom back in. Uh, this is an art. Recovery ring. Hello. 
It has expanded! Okay, uh... First, look for arts. Here is an art. Unlock all the stuff. Holy crap, that's a lot to unlock. Ooh, SP! Sorry, I really want the SP. Uh... That... Oh, that's it! That's all I had space for. Uh, what did you do to Elise? Um... Uh, for her target, I said reduce numbers in insects. Yeah, I might be in grasshoppers before, so I'm used to it. Oh, I've never eaten bugs. I never want to. Um, action, prioritize healing. HP levels, tough it out. Uh, save some TP. Link often. Uh, prioritize healing. And do not use uh, items. Yep. And so she's linked up with Alvin. And with her, I'm going to focus on uh, raising intelligence and, I guess, dexterity. The other one that kind of helps uh, magic. She's got both good heals and spells. Okay, then. Crowning glory. What the heck is this? Look out, guys. There are little bugs everywhere. I wonder if Mila gets bitten a lot in that outfit. You didn't know. She swats the bugs away with her hair. What? Wow, like the tail of a cow! <laughs> Don't compare my crowning glory to the tail of a cow. Crowning glory? I didn't expect such vanity from the Lord of Spirits. Wait, how's... Sylph styled my hair for me. He said, you're in human form, so you need to take care of your appearance. You had the great spirit of wind style your hair? That's incredible! Why does Elise look so much younger in her anime portrait? It's kind of creepy. Yes. I'm quite fond of it. If I swing it around quickly, I can distract a foe between attacks. So it's literally an antenna. So you do swish it like a cow. <laughs> um, then I'll update her to do uh, focus attacks. Um, action. Spirit arts? No. Mainly arts? Mainly arts. HP levels tough it out. Uh, prioritize healing. Yeah. I want to jump back up just to see what's over there before I go on to the next map. Have you seen an anime called Gantz? I heard of it. I never watched it. Boobies. What the heck? <laughs> That's random. I remember seeing movie posters for it when I was in Japan back in like 2008, 2007. Wait, this is where I came from. Where did I come from? <laughs> I came from here? What? Uh... I came from the top? I need to go... West. Okay. I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, so a movie posters for it because... Where am I going? Because uh, one of the dudes from Arashi, which is a J-pop boy band, he was, uh, I think he was the main character in that movie. I never got around to watching it, though. Yes, give me money. I can do this! I hope. It's not working. Time to go to work. Let's go! Can you stop walking? Fine. Oh, am I actually strong now? Of course! Strong and cute! <laughs> strong and cute! North region. I have a feeling I'm gonna hate this place. Is there anything here? A treasure chest! Is there anything else here? No! You're going to right yeah. path, but this one is a secret There's shopping no area you'll get to late game. Like hmm. Uh, I recommend a watch if you like gore, summary, loot. Nope, I do not. <laughs> I do not like those. 
I like um I like Slice of Life. Um Magical Girl. Uh wait, what? Oh yeah, okay. Now I have to go left here. I like Slice of Light, Magical Girl, uh, sports, animes, um, shonen. I think yeah. I can squeeze through here. Better make sure none of us get our clothes stuck. Wizard. Oh, what? Why? Why warning? No breaks. It's over. Oh, right. Let's burn. Level up. Quick blade. Who's next? You did it! Huh? Farewell! You owe me! It's not working! You did it! Farewell! You did well, Elise. Oh no, it was nothing! No need to be modest! Oh, cute! I hope I can get better. Don't worry, I'm here with you! <gasps> She's so cute! Uh, it's pretty edgy. Woo! Do you watch Yuri on Ice? I did, and it was terrible! It, they just showed the same, same skating sequence over and over and over, and I'm like, does he not do anything else, or is this how ice skating is, where you just perform the same routine over and over for um, different competitions? And it's like, they introduced a lot of characters, but then they didn't, um, I, I don't know, it feels like they didn't fully flesh them out, so I was just like, eh. Felt like a waste. Intelligence. Uh, I like. Ugh, oh my gosh. Uh, have you seen or heard of Natsume Yujincho? I have. I never watched it though. <clears throat> That's the one with the cat. Uh, what the heck? Um. Uh, Yes, you perform the same routine. Oh, okay, because I was like, wow, they got really lazy with animating because it's just the same thing over and over and over again. Uh, is this intelligence? Yes, intelligence. We're going to flesh out to get this art. Okay, does anyone else have GP? I don't think they do. Yeah, they don't. Mm. Didn't mean to post any more thing. Uh... Uh -huh. <clears throat> oh, Elisa Spiritology. Where did you learn to channel spirits? Where? I don't remember. She's just really talented. Well, that's why I asked. I've never seen a kid with anywhere near your master's level of skill. Really? I was channeling the four when I was much younger. Well, that's because you're Maxwell. <laughs> you're a special case. Although it does sound like Elise here can channel spirits based on intuition alone, just like Mila. You're really something. You betcha! Jude knows what's what! Remember that you're still a child, though. In combat, you must prioritize self-protection. That's why I have her on heal duty! Oh, okay. Mila's just worried about you. She's right. You be careful out there. Yes, perhaps that's what I should have said. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. So, Mira really does care. It's just she doesn't know how to word things nicely. Okay, okay. Uh... Wait, what? Oh, oh my gosh. Please, please stop that talk. Ugh. Try to keep my chat family friendly, please. Oh, what the heck? Everyone okay? Where... Where is everybody? Wait, what happened? I missed it. I wasn't looking at the screen. The smoke. <clears throat> what is it? <coughs> oh, uh, my eyes. This ain't smoke. She's a spirit. Well, wait, Elise is a spirit? More likely. No, Mita's a spirit. I bet these are smoke shroom spores. Once the spores get in your eyes or nose... She's talking about being human, I guess. Can't stop crying. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's good that she's hanging out with us so that she learns how to be more human. Detroit, become human. That was a interesting cutscene. Why did we have to see that? Is this? Oh, so it's saying like don't. 
touch the mushrooms. Oh no, I can't. Okay, we're gonna eat some tubu. Mapo tubu. Wait, or was it mapo curry? Eat it. Gimme! Aha! Now fight me! That's why she has a hard time expressing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She's my dummy queen. Who said you could duck? You're not allowed to duck! Oh no, my SP is running out. Why do I keep hitting up? Far too easy. Ah, fart. Okay. There's nothing up here. Oh! <gasps> hello, 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 hello. I found bunny ears! Mm, bushy eyebrows. Pet dragon, bushy eyebrows, elf ears. Probably have to. What? <gasps> Goodbye, Bao! Hello, black bunny ears. <laughs> I didn't um modify Lise. Uh bushy eyebrows, yes, and elf ears, yes. Perfect. We are ready. Oh, your skirt is like a parachute. What? My legs are cold. Uh Tivo, don't look up her skirt. Stop blocking. You are not allowed to block. I keep hitting them up to think Jude will juggle them, but they die. <gasps> Everyone's got bunny ears. Ah! Bunny ears looks weird and silly compared to Vesperia. Yeah, Vesperia's is definitely cuter, but hey, bunny ears. I got them this early in the game. I'm using them. Tebow spray! Jude, you wanna hit them? <gasps> Don't just wait for me! We're done! I'm pooped! Oh, he's pooped! Oh, we can't go up. Gotta go through here. Fight me! I don't remember what any of my arts are linked to. I couldn't chain anything. Yummy! did well, at least. Oh no, it was nothing. No need to be modest. Oh, what the f? I didn't slip on anything. Okay, I know this shows a path to somewhere different, but it's out of the way. I want to explore it first. Mysterious liquid. Um. Hi, fight me. Yes, back attack. I'm here. I can't use any more arts. I have no more SP. <laughs> Far too easy. Do 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 smash. Let's just see what's along this way, southwest region. So if I open the map, I'll be able to see. Okay, yeah. I'll explore this area first, then go back to the original path, and do other things. Cool, cool. Ow! Oh, hey, I flipped! I recovered! I don't know how, but I did. I'm trying to do a down attack. Fire! Or not. Oh, if I press square in the air, I'll recover. Alvin has lithium orbs. TP, HP, TP, HP, SP, right there, okay. 
SP. Just want to see if there's any other arts I can unlock. Oh, damn it, over here! Another art for you, sir. Terra Rupture. Cool, cool. Uh, oh, this is an art too. Oh, frack. Uh... Wait. I don't have to fill everything inside here, right? Ah, oh, damn it, I wasted that. Oh well. Just come here. Earn title Jude loves Millia. Mida. Mida. Yay, we've been linked for so long. Last light shell. Woo, come here. You can change battle camera angle on almost all tails during battle. Open the menu and you should see the option to change. There was a, um. There was a thing at the end of one battle where it's like, hey, change your battle camera, and I'm like, I don't care! <laughs> I didn't press up, but okay. Is there a bit better way to have the battle camera? Because I kind of like just having it free roaming. Hi, fight me. Uh, get away from me. Fire! Or not. Oh, I forgot. I have to press circle. Ha 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 ha. Circle with left stick to make the next art. Not right analog stick. Heh <laughs> I thought there was a- wait, no, don't go, there was a shiny. There was a shiny here. Yeah, there you are. Hi. Rotten bone. South region, I think that's where I was at before. Yeah. Yeah, so I came full circle, right? Right? Anyways, let's explore. Um. Zoom out further or closer or level the camera lower or higher. Ah! Ow! Oh, I forgot to press uh, square. Dude, you want to also attack him, please? It wasn't working because you weren't hitting him, Jude! I was trying to hit him too, and Jude was just standing there like derp derp. Ugh. Actually, but now that Elise is here, should I change up my partners? Uh, can I jump down here? I cannot jump. Interesting. Why won't you let me jump? Okay. Ooh, six. Nice. No you owe me. No brakes. Oh, we won. That was too easy. I want more banter filled post battle scenes, please. Put back. Uh wait, I wanna go explore the rest of this forest that I couldn't explore before. It should be quick since I killed all the enemies. Let's go back. But seriously, why can't I jump down here? That's stupid. Ah! Those mushrooms are still in effect. Damn it. Oh, they're back. Okay. Yeah. They're different save points. Oh no, at least the same place. Um... Oh, well, now I'm gonna go back. Hi, fight me, though. I wanna fight you. No breaks. Yeah! I won't fall easily. Do you have my back, Jude? Then attack them, please. It's not working. Okay. My sword rings true. Oh, hey, I love the... Lily or Vermita. 
Uh, HP, please. Strength, please. Art, please. Whirling Assault. Another art over here. Guess I'll unlock you. And then SP. Huzzah! I'll go back. This is where I was, right? Yeah. Oh, mushroom. Everyone's healed up, everyone's good. Let's save again, just because Mira leveled up. Okay, let's go. Give me boss battle! Or not. Hello, Grass Wolf. Okay, they're gonna attack me. I thought they were friends. We meet again. They don't look ready to turn tail and run this time. Get along, little doggies! Little doggies! Hey, it's Evil Dude! I sure wasn't expecting him. Elise, come oh, back doing, with me yeah. now! Good dogs. Thank you for telling me of these intruders. I thought Ivor was the only one who could talk with animals. You're Jow, right? Mm. I don't remember introducing myself. Because you're a rude jerk. We heard your name from the people of Hamel. What do you want? Is that not obvious? I want the little girl. Come, child. We're returning to the village. No. You had me worried sick. I never thought you would leave the village while I was away. Screw you, old man. No, 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 don't let him take us. I'm not going back in the basement. Mm. Do you have any idea how the villagers treated Elise when you left her alone? Yes, but she deserved it. I am truly sorry about You're that. Not. What exactly is Elise to you? Let's just say. I know where she used to live. I know what you did last summer. Where she grew up. In a basement. So will you take her back to her home? No! Or are you planning to lock her up in her mill again? That one. That is my business, and mine alone. You will hand the girl over. No. Don't think so, buddy. Then you leave me no choice. Yes, let me punch your face. They are, right? <laughs> this scene was made more intense because of the eyebrows. No, I don't want to. Please listen to me. You well, no shut your mouth. Ugh, I missed it. No, I couldn't chain that one. Whoopsies. I'm running out of SP. Ow! Ah! Ow! Ow, 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 ow. Wow, I'm really hurt. Oh, okay, he's dead. Girls don't like pesky guys. Ain't that right? Um, well, you're not much better. Ouch. Keep that up, I'll sew your mouth up. <laughs> you're not much better. That wasn't too bad. I hope I can get better. Don't worry, I'm here with you. I thought that would be a lot worse, or a lot longer, but... Man, yeah, that was good. That was manageable. Well, let me guess. You work out? Why must you remain with these people? They will bring you nothing but trouble, I'm sure. You're working it. with the bad guys. You I shut your face. I want to stay with them because they made me their friend. And friends don't leave friends alone! Elise. 
What the heck? The heck? There's a radio on him. A frequency. Mila. Alvin. If it were up to me, I would not bring her back. I am not doing this by they choice. They said friends don't leave friends alone. It sounded so whiny. Tipo did. Oh, he opened his eyes. Just put that away. Bang. So flashy, Alvin. What? Cover your mouth up. Oh, so that's what he meant. I thought there was someone hiding in there. It's like, hey, surprise ambush. I hate Tipo. I love Tipo. He's so cute. He's so funny. You don't want to be alone, huh? Then perhaps all of those people are actually good for you after all. Is he trying to help Elise or hurt her? What the heck? He's the one who kept her locked up in the basement. I don't understand. Lily and then Blooming. Seems to be empty again. When do we Wait, I wanted to skit! With this one. Good performance, but terrible fuel efficiency. I want the skit. Lilium orbs are so pretty! Where did you get yours? I'm not sure. One day, I just noticed it was inside Tipo. Oh, inside Tipo? I found it on the ground! It was so pretty, I couldn't help myself! You ate it? Let's be glad Tipo did. She wouldn't stand a chance out here without it. For a tool of battle, it really is quite beautiful. Uh, the bad guys in Zillia aren't really bad guys. That's why they're the best antagonists for the rest of the series. <laughs> the humans who designed it did quite a fine job. A marvel born of the same human ingenuity that has spawned so many horrors. Well said. Perhaps it's that very duality that defines humans. What is mad? Smoke shrooms! Those whatchamacallit shrooms are something else! It got all smoky. What was that? Those are smoke shroom spores. Clever monsters will wait until their prey gets near one. Then they'll hit the smoke shroom with a rock and take down the prey while its eyes and nose are clouded with spores. And for its part, the smoke shroom gets to spread its spores over a wider area. When life forms help each other like that, it's called symbiosis. I don't think she cares about that, Jude. Okay. She's just like, okay. You're so smart. You, you like do one that. Of those monsters you talked about. So, does that mean people and spirits have symbiosis too? That's right. Humans give mana to the spirits, and the spirits use arts to help people. It's a perfect example of symbiosis. Well done, Elise. Thank you. That's incredible. She has a crush on Jude. Uh, Seymour is a trash bad guy. Are you talking about Seymour from Final Fantasy X? Because yeah, he was trash. He was so bad. Oh. He was gross too. What a creeper. I hate creepers. Jump down. Anything shiny in the trees? Anything shiny in the rocks? Check! I be... Yeah, I didn't understand no, Seymour's hairstyle too. Yeah, it was so dumb. She's talking about you. Yeah, My she most hated. <laughs> Actually, I think Sephiroth is worse than Seymour. Because Seymour got messed up when he was a kid, when he saw his mom um, sacrifice herself and die and he's just like wow the world sucks and so i can understand why he grew up to be like such a creeper per person who hated the world and wanted to destroy it but sephiroth it's like didn't you grow up with a relatively normal childhood like you just didn't know who your parents were but you were like highly ranked in soldier you were well respected like, people did not hate you, and then all of a sudden you read in the laboratory that, like, Oh, my mother is an alien. But it's like, not really, you just used her cells. You were born from a human woman, though. And he just went crazy, and he's just like, Oh, her mother, I gotta destroy the planet. And, like, he didn't even know her! I hate Sephiroth.
Mommy boy is cool? No, no. Seymour was a mommy's boy. Sephiroth is a mommy's boy. Ugh. It's just so dumb. Ugh. I hate Sephiroth. Sephiroth was triggered! <laughs> My mother is an alien. <laughs> Everything you say sounds like an anime title. <laughs> oh, hey, all of my uh, magic points came back. Yay! Uh, the secret art of monster control. You see how that Jiao guy made monsters do his dirty work? Pretty neat trick. Ivor has some ability to control monsters, but it's nowhere near that level. I've heard there's a clan in Anjou that knows the secret art of monster control. Maybe Elise and Chief Jow are from the same clan then? I wonder how it works. Because if Tipo's a monster, she's kind of controlling him. Monsters are a pain. They should just learn to talk like I can. Deli's mom and mom was a... No! <laughs> I'm not an alien! There was an 80s movie with Kim Basinger and Dan Aykroyd called My Stepmother is an Alien. Really? Never knew that. It starred um, Willow from Buffy too. Come Willow, now, Willow, it Willow. This way? Willow. Is she the really redhead? Is she the um, girl who was also in um, How I Met Your Mother? Or is it because Mommy Boy kill off Flower Girl, but Jelly don't want to admit it? I would crush no, I think um, Aerith dying is one of the greatest moments in um, gaming That's history. True. If we could because monsters, we've constantly we grown up with the all. idea that, oh, if you're part of the main cast, you can't die. Nothing Even bad can happen talk, to you. But no, she died and she was gone, and you're just like, F that! So hire an interpreter who's fluent in this language. Yeah, the witch is such trash. Air dying makes me cry to this day. <laughs> I remember <laughs> I was just so shocked, and I'm like, is. is this for real? Because I think I was on the way, I was super close to getting um, Great Gospel for her. Or I already got Great Gospel for her. Whoa. And then she died and I was just like, is this for real? I did all this work trying to get her fourth level limit break. And I was mad. <laughs> Seeing that in HD is gonna kill me. Oh yes, I can't wait to see it in HD. Ah! Ah! The likes of you will not stop me. All right. Uh, now it's if you're the main character, you can't die. Mm -hmm. Like everyone else in the main party is expendable except the main character until the very end of the game. Then he's allowed to die. Like Final Fantasy 15. Final Fantasy 15 was such utter garbage. I'm so mad. Ugh. Uh, Metal Gear Solid was sad. Eris wasn't. I played both in the mid 90s. Yo, Metal Gear Solid is freaking great. The first Metal Gear Solid game, I think that's the best Metal Gear Solid game in that series. I don't know about Metal Gear, because I never played that or saw that. Alvin's Lily Morb is looking pretty weird because like this middle section is empty. <laughs> but honestly, I don't think he needs a lot of um Oh shoot. I should let him learn tech. I might as well fill this up for him next time. Okay. Uh where am I going? I feel like that's where I'm going. Yeah, Charlton. I want to explore the rest of this map though, so let's keep fighting monsters. I'm a monster? Why? Really good in your Why am I a monster? Because I liked Aerith dying? Yes, yeah, the first one I know that game by heart. Oh. I was only able to play that game because my brother beat the game and he got the bandana and the, um... What was it? It's the bandana for stealth and the something else for unlimited ammo. And only after I got those items, I was able to play through the whole game. Uh, are you cosplaying for Halloween? Uh, no, I am not. It costs too much money. 
I mean, I do want to learn how to sew, and I do want to, like, cosplay one day. But... Not yet. Not now. Never get lost. That's impressive. Uh, but Metal Gear Solid 1, so good. And then Metal Gear Solid 4 came out, and it's basically a movie with only like three hours, five hours of gameplay. It's like, what happened to this series? <laughs> or maybe the cutscenes were always that long, and we just never realized it. <gasps> There's a chest just up to. Oh, wait, I can't reach it. Bandana, stealth, and tuxedo? Tuxedo? I didn't know there was a tuxedo. Come here, little tadpole thing. Far too easy. It's almost medication time. Oh shoot. Uh, then I might as well just take it now. Oh, my back is feeling stiff. Maybe because it's getting colder? I don't know. I feel myself getting stiff. Oh, I shouldn't stream for too long. I've only been streaming for an hour. I feel like I've been streaming for two hours. Damn. I cry for Grey Fox and Naomi. Oh my gosh, Grey Fox! Grey Fox was really sad. Naomi, I was just like, oh my gosh, you're gonna betray us? But then at the end, it's just like, oh no! She did love him, and I'm like, frack you! Why do you have to do this to us? Um, oh, hello, SP. Oh, wait, was I trying to get art here? Oh, shoot, I was trying to get art here. Whoops. Oh, and there's SP up there, too. Cool, win-win. Teepocopter. Oh, Jude also leveled up. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. One. Two. A three, a four, there we go. Okay. Uh, a treasure like Elise. How many skits are there? <sighs> Ain't there by the skin of our teeth? Tell her, I, tell her I'm, I'm the one who did it. It's my fault. Killed her the parents and raised her. I know, you. that was just like, ah. Don't be mad at Ellie. It's like after she found out, like how she must have felt. Like, the one ah! The There's nothing for you to apologize for. I teared a bit for the ending of Vesperia and Xenoblade Chronicles too. <sighs> but Vesperia's ending was good. It was happy. Don't worry. I we'll liked it. You. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're a real pal, Alvin. It ain't every day a treasure like you falls into my lap. Why would you? What? Huh? Because you're such a gifted channeler, I mean. You know, so you'll be a big help to me, too. No, he has ulterior motives with her. I think he's gonna, like, sell her. Or give her up to some shady people he's working with. I don't trust you, Alvin. Don't trust you at all. Tears of joy. <laughs> ah! Thank you for helping me up, Jude. I forgot to press square. What? How am I missing him? Right. Hello, I freeze treasures. Toko. There should be at least one here. I haven't seen one. Oh, over here? What the heck is this for? This random hole. Jude, I am attacking this bee! Why are you not helping me? You jerk. Okay, don't get too close to the exit. Okay, I guess there's no IP treasure here. Uh, unlike Jelly who cheated using the DLC, I had to grind for hours and got attached to characters. The only reason why I didn't grind was because I was streaming and I didn't want to, like, spend hours and hours just level grinding. I thought people would get sick of it, so I just bought the DLC for leveling up. Otherwise, I would have got- I would have level grinded to max level 
I would have gotten all the um, final weapons. Eunice is incredible at but I just wanted to go through the story. Her manalobe must be far more developed than normal. That's not true. I wish Giselle's part of the main cast. I think that's her name. Giselle? In the spirit? I wish yours was too. Well, I certainly do. Must be nice to have such a powerful manalobe when you're channeling, huh? I guess. I really don't think about it. Well, you should, since the manalobe is inside your brain. Wait, really? I hear that sometimes the spirits will help themselves to a nice. Don't chunk scare of her like that, Alvin. So don't channel too much. Or that pretty little skull of yours will end up as hollow as a coconut. Ah! <laughs> I don't want that to happen. Come on, Alvin. Don't scare her like that. Yeah, Alvin, you're a jerk. The joy of smoke shrooms. So Don't many skits in this shrooms. area. What the heck is happening? Yeah, they're a famous delicacy around here. Zilia, see her next town. Oh, okay. Do they taste good? Better than you might think. I hear they're especially good in stew. Hey, I love stew. Me too. What if you steam them with garlic and butter? Would that be good? Mushrooms are disgusting. Sure sounds good to me. You could make cream of smoke shrooms. Stew. Gross. What if they were wrapped in bacon? Gross! That would be amazing! Wow, Elise. I didn't realize you liked food so much. Oh, I... I just... She's having a growth spurt! Don't judge! <gasps> Mushrooms are disgusting. Ba -na 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 -na. Mushrooms are disgusting. Burr, 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 burr. Maybe I feed treasures up here? On a rock? Or in a tree. Uh, I was working on 100%ing Vesperia, but got demotivated because I found out that part of the game was missing on the Xbox 360, like the character Patty. Oh yeah, I think you guys mentioned that when I was playing Vesperia, that um, Patty and Flynn were not part of the Xbox cast. That freaking sucks. But I mean, isn't that better to 100% it because then there's two less characters that you have to worry about? Oh man, but I would feel sad if I didn't have Patty in my party. She's so freaking cute. Okay. It's over. Let's show our skills. Does that mean that the pirate ship dungeon where you find Eifried Spirit is not in the Xbox version? You're making me look bad. Oops, I didn't press L2. You can? Oh. Still do better. Ooh. Melange gel. I still have not encountered a an eye free treasure here. Much disappoints. Hi, fight me. I thought insects don't like fire. Is that a lie? Never got far in the 360, I wouldn't know. I don't remember since it's been over four years from my last playthrough of the spear. Uh, okay. Jeff Black. I'm getting so many freaking feathers. Is there anything special up here? There has to be something special up here. Otherwise, why would they have this? Yeah, get back up where I can hit you. Don't run away, B. You did well, Elise. Do, 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 do. Earn title, Monster Slayer! I can slay monsters, I can't hunt them. Ouch, bird! Need a leveled up! Black Feather is a part of a quest, if I remember. Oh, shoot, so then I shouldn't use them all for expanding uh, shops and whatnot. 
Wait, can I climb up there? Did I climb up there earlier? No, I don't think I did. Oh, wait, this is a totally new section of the map. What? Wait, what? Have I been here? I don't think I have. On another note, I gave up playing Tentu because I just hated the characters. <laughs> They're not too bad. I mean, the only new girl is Pain. Oh, damn, Melvin. He's strong. Uh, make you run faster by turning them in or- Oh, or party of a cameo boss battle. I want to run faster. Harder, better, faster, stronger. Something, something, faster, stronger. This one is mine. Oh. Can't wait for you to play the best tail game. Don't worry. Eventually, I will play Symphonia. It is on my list. And next year, when Arise comes out, whenever it decides to come out, I'll be playing Arise, too. Ugh. Get ready and boot for Black Feather? Yeah, I want to run! Fast. Gotta go fast. Oh man, my back hurts. Hi, plant! Fight me. Okay. It's over. Burn. Stop blocking! Hey, don't- no casting. Jude, attack it, please! Why are you just standing there doing nothing? Uh, Tales of Abyss. Abyss needs to be remastered. Abyss. 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 Is that the one with the red hair dude as the main character? He has long red hair. I came from the left side, so let's try going up here. Mm hmm Okay. Is his name Luke? I'm trying to remember all the main characters' names. Oh, hey. I can crawl. Hi, B. Oh, super secret. Dang. Also, the more I talk about Tales games, um, <laughs> the more people pop up to say that Berseria was the worst one ever. <laughs> And I'm just like, wow, now I'm afraid to play it. Maybe that should be lower on my list of um, Tales games to play. <laughs> you should try Symphonia like what you did for Zillia, a test stream, but I don't... Uh, I think it's too soon to try. It's bad, just burn it. <gasps> but it's Regal's favorite! I want to give everyone's favorite Tales a shot. Except, um, yeah, Zillia 2, I do definitely want to play back-to-back -back after Zillia 1. Just so that everything is, like, fresh in my mind. Still no ivory treasure. What the heck? I recommend the Tales of Vesperia. I take all the credit. <laughs> I recommend Tales of Destiny. <laughs> Tales of Destiny? Hmm. I'm gonna have to look that one up. I don't think I heard anything about it. All I know is that Berseria and Zesteria are getting lower and lower on my priorities of Tales to play. It's PS1? Old school? Damn. I wonder if it's on the PlayStation Store. I can't take any more orange gels! Can I use them at least? There we go. Yes. Uh, I want to play Destiny again for the... Wait, what? As it is my first... But I won't legit want to play on PS1, dang. Do PS1... Working PS1s even exist anymore? I mean, I could probably play it on my PS2, since um, PS2 has backwards compatibility. And I think I still have a PS1 memory card. That I can use. I'm glad I saved everything. Basil. 
My PS1 broke back in 2005. Oh, that sucks, dude! Oh, just for to say that it's your first Tales. Oh, so Destiny was the first one you ever played. Uh huh. Oh shoot, I haven't been leveling up Lily Morbs. Whoopsies. Let's do that right now. Uh, this is an art. Yeah, it's the first Tales game ever. Oh whoa. Okay, then yeah, that. That one definitely deserves a shot of being played. It's like you started a great era. I think you could play PS1 games on the PS2 and 3, you just need a memory card. Yeah, um, well some PS3s can play it. Because I think some PS3s are backwards compatible, not all of them. Ah, damn it, I forgot I was going to do this art. Uh, I'm a fool. But I don't think not all PS3s can play it. I think my PS3 can't play it because it's a newer one. Just want that SP. And let's see, let's get this. SP! Everyone's Lilium orb thing is gonna look so messed up. <laughs> It's gonna be unfilled holes. It's gonna look so ugly. Uh, ah! Hello. Don't get killed. You can play it on specific PlayStation. Yeah. Unless it's in the um, PlayStation Store, where you could just download it and play it. This is the power of Maxwell. That's the power of love. Boom. Boom. Climb up. Oh my gosh. My back hurts. Uh... Oh, there it is! Ivy's treasure! Mysterious jewel. Boo! I want an accessory. Boo! Oops. Memory cards are so old school, kids nowadays will never realize the struggle of playing games without having the ability to save. Uh-huh. Like, I remember the very first time I got PlayStation 2, I didn't realize you also needed memory cards. And the guy at um, Toys R Us didn't tell me that I needed to buy a memory card also, because I guess he didn't know. So I went home. I started playing Chrono Cross, and I couldn't save, and I was like, what? And then um, I went online, and I read that you have to get different memory cards for play PlayStation 1 games and PlayStation 2 games. And I was like, what the heck, this sucks! So I had to go back to, um, did I go back to Toys R Us, or did I go to, um, did I go to uh, GameStop? And then I got memory cards, and then I could finally play Chrono Cross and Final Fantasy X. Who's next? Of Maxwell. Dude, Game Sharks. Oh heck yeah, I abused Game Shark for Super Nintendo. I was like, I want all the monies and all the final weapons and all the final spells before I even get to the final boss. Ah, <sighs> oh. that was such a cheater. I don't see any holes on this side of the rock. Oh hi. Or not having any saves like in all the old NES games. Oh yeah. Chrono Crossle has some of the best opening music ever. Heck yes, it does. I love the Chrono Cross music. Freaking Yasunori Mitsuda. So good. And it had such a good ending theme too. Like I remember wanting to learn how to play Radical Dreamers, the guitar riff. And I did learn how to play that. And I was like, I'm so cool! I can play video game music on a guitar! 
Legend of Dragoon, Legend of Legia, Chrono Cross, 7 and 8, Grandia, Wild Arms, Breath of Fire 3, Zeto Gears, Alundra, Lunar, Mega Man, Legend, Castles, Vania, Symphony of the Night. Names I could think of at the top of my head when I hear t Tales of Destiny. Really? Dang. That's a lot of games. You have some good taste. <gasps> Dang. I think I found everything down here, so I just go back up, right? Yeah, I have to go back up. Take me up! Don't want to mention Suikoden and Saga Frontier because I never finished it. Yeah, that's one series that just kind of like faded away. Suikoden! I played all the Suikoden games and the last one, five, came out... Was it... early 20... 2010s? Yeah, because I think I was still in... I was still in college or grad school. And I was like, wait, where's the next recording game? It's just not there. Saga Frontier... Yeah. Saga was revolutionary. Oh, yeah, Web, I was looking up info. I don't think it's Saga Frontier that they're remaking, but it's, um... Romancing Saga. If that's part of the same universe, I don't know. Uh, Resident Evil 4, Burnout, Devil May Cry, Dynasty Warriors 2 to 4. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So many good PS1 games. Dynasty Warrior had some pretty cringe voice acting. Of course it did! It's still fun! Just like as a general, like, hack, hack and slash game. It's kind of like relaxing. Best PlayStation era. Honestly, PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2, I think, had some of the best games ever. Ever. Like, if I have to think of what the best system is ever, 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 I think PlayStation 2. I think they had the most hits. Like, Switch is great and all, but a lot of their games are just like remasters or remakes of older games. But we'll see what new games they come out with in the future. And I just love Super Nintendo because I love the pixel Boy, style you never follow us into a place like this oh. oh I think it's like the fourth or so soccer game but what only one was really good oh okay they hey, changed the style after check one out this shop. it looks pretty interesting it's 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 Lubo Look, please browse all you want. <laughs> looks like PS1 PS2 but also SNES oh, yes nice. This is why I think this is why I like older games because they were just so good so and tense? focused and well developed and fleshed <sighs> out. Now all we get are just remakes, remastered here. HD. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really I want to see play. original games. Not very good for business, that's for sure. Whoa, it's the same old dude. We see him uh, everywhere. Right. Um, oh wait, he saw our faces from the poster, didn't he? That girl is cute. Pretty expensive, that's for sure. You have a good eye, young lady. That's a genuine freak fired cup. Mira's gonna be like, no, that's a lie. So this was handmade by a freak? Nope. Huh. Well, I highly doubt that. It looks like these patterns are far too wild. A freak values order over all else. <laughs> well, you talk as though you've had the honor of breaking bread with one of the four great Wait a minute, wait a minute. Your is he my next party member? True Afrit fired ceramics are known for their geometric precision. He's my next party member! This old dude, this right? He says that this set was made over 18 years ago. I see. Yes? Uh, what about it? That's quite peculiar, if I'm not mistaken. He's a nurse joy of this universe. Ha 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 ha. around 20 years ago. Uh, have I played any <laughs> Dynasty Warrior games? I have. I don't remember the number of it, but it was definitely on PlayStation 2. I played it with my friend in college. I grew up as a Sega gamer, but I have traded for Super Nintendo. <laughs> Luffy had changed my view in gaming, my very first JRPG. Hmm. I got quite a good deal. Thanks to your help. And yes, he is my next party member. Those are some big AI brows. Heck and yes, give me them thick eyebrows. 
I'm happy to be at your service. Wait, he's a butler. Again, you simply must join me for tea. He's gonna leave her to join me? Is she gonna die? Well, we'd have turned down a free lunch. Shall we swing by later? Oh, her outfit's so cute. She's just cute. Holy crap. Oh, she's so cute. The girl next to the old man I want to be our main cast. Yes, I... I want her to be main cast too. She's so cute. I can think of several reasons we might want to Damn it. Did you ever fight Lubu? Um... He's right, actually. I don't Stay remember. Could be risky with all these guards everywhere. I just remember oh, I was like was helping my friends because we. Uh, <laughs> she was doing all the missions and I was just like, okay, let's go. Bop, bop, bop. And I thought it was fun. Keep playing. I like her. <laughs> I mean, I still have like half an hour left on stream. Oh, traces of the toy peddler. Ah, that's right. The peddler who sells TPOS toys might be in Sherilton. Let's ask around town and find out if anyone's seen any talking stuffed animals. Wow! I'm so excited! Maybe the shop has something rare for sale. A quick look wouldn't hurt. I gotta talk to the little girl! Hey, have you ever seen anyone who looks like me? Hello, a talking doll. It's just like the other ones I saw. Where did you see them? How does a girl that's smaller than Elise sound have a more mature voice? Then Elise. A toy merchant was selling them here not too long ago. But then Elise's voice is like, okay. Where can we see this person? I don't think he's here anymore. He said he was going to some sea haven next. Do you remember which one? Hmm. Um. It takes her this long to answer. Oh my gosh, she's really still thinking about it. Holy crap. This is sure taking a lot of time. Oh, that's it. It was a lot of Sea Haven. Can't say I recognize that. Oh, wait. You mean a lot of Sea Haven? Oh my gosh, but that's where we started well, hey, off from. Nice work, me. Gosh, I'm so jealous. I wish my She sounded really familiar, the little NPC those. girl. Let's kidnap her. No, kidnapping is wrong. <laughs> Okay, there was a shiny on this cart. Watching these people haggle for merchandise sure is fascinating. Five call, boo. Uh, wait, is there something here? May I interest you in our specialty? Just 100 gold each. Um, sure. Ice pop. Whoa, if I get a wind stick, I get another for free. Cool. Um, is there a weapon seller here? Is it only an item seller? I have to go to her house. Giselle. Oh wait, item shop is this way. Yeah, this way. And I didn't see anyone else with ex- Did I see anyone else with exclamations above their head? Just want to make sure I don't miss any um, side quest stuff. Wait, what am I talking about? I just want to get through the story. <laughs> I shouldn't focus on side quests. Muttons! Fresh muttons! Wow, what a huge city! Fresh I've buttons! I've never been anywhere <laughs> like this before. Hey, there's too many people and it's super noisy! But on, but off. Uh, expands. And we expand you. Heck yes! I got tons of feathers! Yes. Oh, I don't have as many feathers as I thought. Yes. File blade. Cool. Um, armor shop? Beasts. Heck yeah, I got so many rotten bones! There we go. Yes! Give me all the goods. Um, item shop? What do you want? Fish? I got plenty of fishy stuff. Yes. 
The launch gel syrup bottle. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, accessory shop food vendor. Nah, accessory shop? Ores. Oh, wait, not too much. I need to save some for a uh, food vendor. Food vendor! There we go. Oh, now I can buy parfait. Oop! I want to buy stuff. You hear him? No, I I didn't. Mutton man will still be there in Zilly too. Ha ha ha! Jerry Nigel's heading out. Oh, good night, Web. Thanks for joining. Uh, let's buy one. Equip. Yes, Mace. Hello. Oh, I forgot. I have to get good stuff for um. At least now too. Damn it. What a splendid windmill. Where? Windmill Miller. You lied. I don't see one. Uh, iron guard, feather coat, iron mail, silk cloak, bronze helm, headdress, green ribbon. Okay. Well, first of all, iron guard. Yes. Uh, iron mail, silk cloak, bronze helm. Where did all my money go? I thought it was rich! The heck? I'm dirt poor now! Frack! Well, I guess no accessories then. Here. He would have helped me climb up on top of it. Uh, where's her house? Colmar Trail... Where's her house? <laughs> That's the inn. Uh, I'm gonna save here and talk to those exclamation point gentlemen. Ugh. I just hope Giselle doesn't die. Giselle doesn't die, right, KV? She can't die. That can't be why Ronan enjoys us. Sure All these equipments will be found in the next dungeon field. Are you for real? Then why did I buy them? Uh, we did. We came in through I could have just held on to all that money. Well, good on you for making it all this way. I bet going through that checkpoint wasn't much fun. It sure wasn't. Well, it wasn't that bad. We used to be able to trade with Ajul freely. But now, with all these new regulations, it's almost impossible to do business. Hey, it's like Brexit. <laughs> I've heard things are getting weird at Fort Gondala, too. I hear they're working on some kind of big-time spirit art. You think maybe, it's maybe not. Keep war? playing to find out. <laughs> it could well be. Between Rashigal and Ajul? But why? I'm sure you've seen how the King of Rashigal has been consolidating power around himself. While on the other hand, the king of Arjul is some great hero who united all of the tribes by force. Two strong rulers in two neighboring countries. It's only natural they'd start bumping against each Just other. Just live in peace. There have been skirmishes, but we haven't had open war since the Battle of Fezabel 20 years ago. Hey, this could be the business opportunity of a lifetime. What are you talking about? <sighs> I'm sure it's possible. But the people who got greedy during the last war were the first ones to die. Why am I listening to this? Yeah, you're right. These new inspections have been pretty devastating to our business already. Hey, don't let it get you down. War isn't a certainty yet. That NPC kind of sounds war. like Matt Mercer. Did Matt Mercer voice different characters in this game? We should meet with yourself for tea first. Well, I don't know where her house is. Is it this one? No, this is the inn. I don't think Giselle lives at the inn. Oh, hello. Not another one. My parents keep sending me these. They're nothing but portfolios of men they want me to marry. I keep telling them I don't want to get married yet, but they won't shut up about grandchildren. 
But of course, that's not your problem. Thanks for taking the time to deliver this. I got sunglasses! Do, 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 do. Let's get rid of elf ears for sunglasses. Heck yes! Yo, everyone get in sunglasses now! <laughs> Check it. Oh! Yes! Well, Jude, well. it looks good on you. I didn't realize you were so into fashion. Mila, are you nervous about something? No one's ever asked me over for tea before. It seems I'm a bit excited. About Giselle. Oh, find out about her. I thought you meant, like, find out about getting weapons in the field. Uh, oh! He voiced one of the bad guys in Zillia. Mercer? It sounds like he voices Alvin, though. For you. Unless he doesn't voice Alvin and it's Travis Willingham instead? I don't know, it sounds like one of the two. Wow. You live here? No, I don't think Travis Willingham is Alvin. I think Travis's voice is more hmm. I should go soldiers. Wait. Oh, hello. Who the heck are you guys? Who was that? Have our guests departed? If Rowan, Rowan, Ronan is the butler, why is he hanging around Giselle? Welcome back. Brought your friends, I see. Because if he's the butler, he should be minding the house. Klein, let me introduce you. Oh, um, I never got their names. <laughs> we look so cool. I hear you came to my sister's <laughs> aid. Oh, they're siblings. I'm Klein Cheryl. I'm Drissel's older brother, as you've no doubt guessed. White hair, red bang, Mercer, I think. Hmm. Lord Klein is the governor here in Sherylton. Really? We look so cool. I love this getup. Oh my gosh. How rude of us to keep you waiting outside. Please, let's continue our conversation in comfort. I think Klein looks cool. His outfit looks super comfortable. And Giselle's just cute! Oh, I wish they both could have joined us. Ugh. I see. So you protected my sister from wasting her money on worthless trinkets again. Worthless trinkets? It's not worthless. Besides, I got a good deal and made some new friends in the bargain. Oh, the two guys we saw earlier? Ah. <laughs> Elise, you look so cool! <laughs> Alvin, you can sit too. It's not a crime to sit down. Rowan, please look after our guests. It would be my pleasure, sir. I have some matters to attend to, if you will excuse me. I've got to run to. Alvin! Huh? Nature calls. I better leave now before things get messy. No, he's scheming. He's planning to black, black, backstab us. So you're on some great journey, right? You simply must tell me all about your travels. They have really interesting clothes, well, um, uh, Giselle and Klein. They look so cool. I've never even been out of this town. I want to hear all about the far Haters gonna hate, Elise. <laughs> I've never been outside either, but then... 
Ellie became pals with Jude and everyone. We crossed mighty oceans and explored forbidden forests. We saw giant waves and toadstools that made everyone cry. I ate everyone's faces. We sailed across the sea, Ellie. I've never even seen the sea before. What was it like? It's vast and wild, teeming with dangerous creatures. There are giant octopuses pretending to be rocks. <gasps> I want to see these octopus. Rock octopuses? You don't say. Oh, I want to eat octopus. <laughs> and fish and eels and clams. Oh, I've seen clams. Uh, the shells anyway. They sell shell jewelry in the shops in the plaza. It's all so gorgeous. That's You're so gorgeous, really nice. Giselle. I'll give you one of my favorite pieces as a present next time. As a token of our friendship. Characters in video games are so willing to give away their favorite things. I'm like, I can't give away my favorite jewelry? things. It's my this favorite. Gotta see. I'll give you my second favorite or third favorite. Saving presents is a way to establish friendship. Something green just sparkled in the back. The heck was that? Uh, why, yes. To the giver, a present is a symbol of trust. To the receiver, a present serves as a warm reminder of our friendship. Never been to the sea before, sounds like Estelle. <laughs> and getting stuff for They're both sheltered princesses. I see. <laughs> It would appear my young mistress has made some very good friends. Make yourselves at home. Help yourself to tea and treats. Give me all the treats. Uh, let's see, 151. Hmm. It's almost my two hour mark, and I'm feeling a bit achy. I've been in the service of Lord Klein for about two let's just talk, now. finish talking with the characters in here. He is a fine ruler, despite his youth. He believes in freedom and equality for his people. If he has any real flaw, it's that he spoils Lady Dressel too much. That's all I had to talk with you, but that's why you had the exclamation point above your head? Snoop, bing, snoop, bing. Can't really snoop. Giselle and I are going out later to look at cute accessories together. Okay. Uh, Jude. Hmm? You certainly seem in good spirits. Of course he is. He's surrounded by cute girls. I am. Look how happy Elise is. It's a real relief. She's been through so much lately. So have you. Especially considering how much you obsess over the well-being of others. I'm feeling pretty good. We finally got in a little downtime, and the refreshments were great. And surrounded by cute girls! I see. I'm glad to hear it. But we can't get too comfortable, I suppose. Correct. I just want to poke Mira's belly button no every noise. time I see it. It's just His like, manner isn't the smartest place There's a hole life. right there! Uh, I'm getting tired. <laughs> we can't stay here long. Oh, is there a save point? I need to save. I'm getting tired. Uh, Lord Manor's gates? What about upstairs? Is there a save point upstairs? Please, give me the sweet release of death. Guest room. Lies! There's nothing here! No pilfering! Uh, other side? What is this? A bird! The scroll of Sheryl Kresnik, the Genesis Sage. In the beginning, chaos reigned over the formless void, but Kresnik, the Genesis Sage, did conquer this chaos. In his right hand, a lance of righteousness, in his left, a vessel for a shelled world. He set forth from the old lands and made a covenant with Maxwell, Lord of Spirits, and thus did they open the frontiers of the sacred realm, Rees Maxia. Give me at least a treasure, dude. I didn't realize Bowel was gone. Yeah, I had to get rid of Bowel because I wanted the eyebrows and the sunglasses and the bunny ears. 
Wait. Yeah, if I wanted the bunny ears, I had to get rid of Bao. And I want them bunny ears. Klein? Why the unfriendly face? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa? I'm afraid I can't permit you to leave just yet. Why? Now that I know it was you who infiltrated the laboratory in Fenmont. How would you, why would you care about that all the way out here? It wasn't us. We have sunglasses and thick eyebrows. What are you talking about? Save your denials. Alvin told me everything. Alvin! The eyebrows look terrible. No, I think they're the best! <laughs> she did what? Now what? Will you hand us over to the military? No. I want to know what you saw in that facility. Nothing. Get out of our face. Rashigal has undergone dramatic changes ever since Noctigal exceeded the throne. Noctigal? For real? That's his name? Even those of us in the six ruling houses are not told of his activities. The military is holding people captive and draining their mana to develop a new weapon. Human experimentation? He would go that far? Are you a bad guy, Klein? Or are you a good guy? I really like your outfit. I'd like to believe you're lying, but all the pieces fit. So Nautical is the man behind the experiments? The king of Roshigal? He would have to be. <sighs> it's hardly hospitable to keep Drissel's friends captive in our home. Okay, so he's a good guy. But you must leave this city at once. No! When we find Alvin, we're gonna punch his face so Thank hard. You, Lord Why would he tell Quine that we infiltrated the lab? What the heck? Giselle, I love you. Bye. Oh, Ellie, you and your friends didn't do anything wrong. It's sad to think I might not see you again. It is indeed. Alvin, let me destroy you. Drizelle's house sure is huge. Yeah, this might be bigger than my entire school. Finish up, finish up. Uh, making friends. There's a bunch of kids in Sheraton's Plaza. Looks like some of them are your age. Why not try to talk to them? That was it? Oh my gosh, these subskits suck. Give me a save point. I'm I truly admire the dedication of these sentries to their mission, but if they stand in my way, I will have no choice but to cut them down. Cool, Mita. Okay, that's it for me. You should grow out your eyebrows and walk around in public. Yeah, I wish I could, but my eyebrows aren't getting any thicker. <laughs> also, it's a gag in, um, in Asia where you cut seaweed into thick rectangles and you just plaster them on your eyebrows. I think that's why I like it. It's a gag. Maybe I don't like RPGs anymore because I don't have patience. I have patience. <laughs> I love exploring stories. Uh, Subskits are side quests. Oh, they're side quests! So that's why I have to talk with the kids. I mean, time. I mean, I don't have a lot of time either, but I still love playing RPGs. <laughs> okay, well, that's it for me tonight because I'm starting to feel really stiff and achy and I need to move around. Um, so yeah, I think I'll stream Wednesday and Thursday. I'll be playing I, Somnium Files. I don't know if I'll be able to finish it then because I don't know how many pads are still left in that game. But, oh well, I'm looking forward to playing it. And anyways, thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time. Stay toasty. Have a good night, everyone. Bye-bye. Oh wait. Okay, well, maybe I don't like RPGs anymore because I'm dead on the inside. <laughs> well, that's why you play games to make you feel happy. But anyways, good night. See you later. Bye-bye.